Niagara Falls is one of the most famous waterfalls in the world. We recently got to spend an action-packed 24 hours there, where we rode on the Maid of the Mist, got super close to the falls at Cave of the Winds, saw spectacular fireworks, and even got to go to the casino. This was one of our favorite days in America so far. I mean, I know. Yeah, we just parked at Niagara by like the fake tourist center. So now we're walking seven minutes to the real tourist center to try and just buy like individual tickets. It's really cute here though, no? Yeah. There's like a state park and bike rentals yeah. and tons of like food things. Carla saw a hard rock. I want to go to Hard Rock. Which maybe, maybe we'll go to because he still hasn't had a burger in America. I mean, you've been here less than a week. Everything is new for me. <laughs> yeah, so. Well, so we will see. Maybe we'll go to the Hard Rock later. I don't know. The water is right there. And here, visitor center under construction. Right. Just went to the visitor center and yeah. failed again. <laughs> you can buy tickets here. Yeah. She said you buy the tickets at the actual attractions. Yeah. So if we walk 30 seconds this way, we get to Maid of the Mist and we can buy those tickets. And then for Cave of the Winds, we have to cross over to Goat Island and buy tickets there. I see them there. Yeah, so it's literally right here. Last boat, last boat, every 15 minutes. And you can't book tickets ahead of time online. You have to book here. Hi. Hi. Uh, two adults, please. Pay for the boat? Yes. Tickets you receive and souvenir postcards up the stairs to the green building. Great, thank you. Thank you. Hello, good morning. Hey, free postcards. Right. How cool is that? We yeah. were going to buy one and now I got it for free. Your dad is going to be happy. And your parents. There's yeah. two. Yeah, so two people, 56, 50. But we're at Niagara Falls. Yeah, it's once in a lifetime. Seriously? At least for me. <laughs> Hello, Canada. The closest you've ever been to Canada. Yeah, we can do a visa run. Wow, look. Whoa. That's Niagara Falls. That's crazy. Amazing. That's crazy. It's so windy. That's going to be us on the boat. Yeah. So this is the American side with the blue coats, and over here is the Canada side with the red raincoats. That's cool that we're like color-coded. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> You're having more issues than me. <laughs> Keep going. There you are. Alright. Everyone's off. There weren't a lot of people on there at all. This is amazing. I thought we'd have to wait, yeah. No waiting at all. We're in the boat. Yeah. And we're leaving. It is so windy. I don't think you can hear anything except these trash bags. Oh my god. It looks crazy. <laughs> Carlos, is, <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> Look at me. <laughs> I mean, so far we're not really wet. Yeah. Just a tiny bit, yeah. but no not as bad as I thought it would be. Yeah. I think that when we get to the horseshoe, it'll be crazy. <laughs> Oh, this one here is Cave of the Winds. So you see? Yeah. All these? Yeah. This is one where it says you get wet. But that's only open in the summer. So we should probably try and do that after, no? Another $21, but... To get that close to the falls. And you can't even see the waterfall, it's just water.
We are in the waterfall now. and you walk from America to Canada. But we don't know about Carlos's visa, how it's gonna be if we walk across the bridge. We have our passports, so maybe, maybe we'll try later. So we're back now, only 18 minutes after we left. It's super fast, but yeah, really fun. How was the Maid of the Mist? The boat tour? One of the most amazing things I've ever seen. Yeah? Yeah, the wonderful, yeah. Yeah, no, I can't believe I've never been here before. It's just crazy when you are there in the middle and you cannot see. Uh -huh. <laughs> Definitely worth it. On the side and yeah. Yeah, you cannot see anything in 10 meters. Uh -huh. We weren't sure if we were going to make it to Niagara and I'm so happy we came. Yeah, right? so fast, yeah. So it's your entrance to Crow's Nest. We don't know what it is, but we're going to walk up and try and find out. I know, I think it's going to be very, very wet over here. But at least we still have the free ponchos. <laughs> yeah. I need to look tidy. Tie it. <laughs> Carlos is ready. More or less. Yeah, <laughs> look at me. I think so. Cute. Yeah. Are you ready? Yeah. I mean, we're gonna do this for free, no? Yeah, yeah, it's included with the ticket, I guess. A lot of people skipped it and just went back up the elevator, but a couple of us came over here. I'm so think it's worth it is. Uh, I don't know. You get drenched and you can't. Yeah, you you're gonna really see there, yeah. We're yeah. now. Yeah. I don't know if it's worth it yet. How wet are you? Okay. Oh, this a fine. little. It blew up over my shorts. My shorts yeah. are wet. On the boat it wasn't bad. Like we just got a little wet, but that crow's nest, I'm soaked. Like I don't think that was really worth it. No, 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 no. Island. Caution, you will get wet. Thank you. $42 for this one, $21 each. At the end of this tunnel, we get ponchos. He said it's about a half hour, a loop that you walk around. That takes a half hour. That's longer than I thought. Right, we have yellow ponchos now for a Cave of the Winds. Yeah. It says, Cave of the Winds. Do not enter. Cave of the Winds starts here. There goes the boat. At least it's very sunny right now. The sun is yeah. strong. It is strong. Wow. Seriously. And apparently they take all these ramps down during the off season. So it's only open, I don't know, the end of May maybe or June until September. Also, this is supposed to be the closest you can get to the waterfalls. It said like 15 feet to Bridal Fall. Oh my God. This part's so wet. Right on top of 
top of the falls. It's getting wet now. Ah! It's scary, huh? Yeah. yeah. So oh my god. Fun. There's the hurricane deck. Huh? I guess that's the most wet part, the hurricane yeah. deck. Right under it. That's insane, yeah. been here like two hours and we did both the Maid of the Mist and Cave of the Wind. So $49 to do the two main ones. And yeah, it's so easy to walk between them. But yeah, now we are going to check into our hotel, which is an interesting place. I'm excited to see it. So we are staying at Aaron House, a living museum Airbnb from a Civil War era. And everything is like Super old here. There's like different things you can look at, like outfits from Civil War. The whole dining room here is really cool. And here is our bathroom. So there's all these secret doors. You have to pull this, and this is our bathroom. <laughs> so cool there's also an upstairs these are all the different wallpapers that they found in the house since like the 1860s so many here's a shared kitchen and behind this one another secret door where are we eating yeah your first time at the hard rock in Niagara. Hey, right, it's very American. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> what do you want? You still haven't eaten a burger in America. A messy burger. A messy burger. There you go. That's for you. <laughs> so I got nachos for my meal, and Carlos got a pulled pork, which he tried a bite of my dad's last week and loved it. So now he has his own. God bless America. <laughs> <laughs> it's so good, yeah. It's amazing. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. Is it your favorite American food so far? Yeah. <laughs> and ever, maybe. Nice. <laughs> How was your first American dining experience? Amazing. Yeah. That's so good. You like your pulled this pork? This is what they wanted to eat here. Mm -hmm. Oh, this yeah. stuff, yeah. I think Carlos was impressed. Yeah, also good. So there is one casino here on the American side of Niagara Falls, and we're gonna go check it out. the coolest casino you've ever been to? I mean, yeah, it's huge. Yeah. <laughs> it's so weird because in Spain in the casino you have to dress up like, well. Yeah, we are not dressed up. <laughs> yeah. And you cannot take videos. <laughs> yeah, but here we're just walking around. We passed a waitress and asked if you get free drinks when you play and she said, yeah. So, we That's got free wedding. drinks. <laughs> yeah. Salud. So at least it makes the casino worth it because, yeah, you just play slots and you get drinks. Yeah, because we are not winning anything. We'll finish our last, like, 60 cents we have and then go see the light show. Yeah. How'd your casino experience end? Good. We... Tight. No, we Tied. didn't. Tight? <laughs> you can see it. We broke even. We broke even. We yeah. didn't 
we didn't lose anything. Yeah. And now the light show has already started. So we're gonna run down to the river, see if we can see anything, maybe go to Canada if we can't see anything, yeah. I don't know. The fireworks should start in 30 minutes. Yeah. Rainbow Bridge pedestrians to Canada through the parking lot. What is the warning? Are subject to inspection by the U.S. Border Agency and must present proper documentation for readmission to the United States. Do you have proper scared. documentation? I'm We're standing here at the gate. I'm yeah, Carlos is really nervous because obviously he's not American. He has a Spanish passport and he needed like an ets, esta, yeah. esta to come to America. Like he needed this other paper. And now he's worried if we go through here and we go to Canada, he won't be allowed back. Because it says all this stuff, like, do not go through the gate unless you have all your papers, blah, blah, blah. We are not going to Canada. So dangerous. We've had a good day, and we don't want to ruin it by Carlos getting stuck <laughs> in Canada. So, we are just going to walk down the Niagara Falls State Park, U.S. side, and find somewhere to see the light show and the fireworks. Yeah, that's all. It's too complicated. Yeah. yeah. It's not worth it. <laughs>